thing. <laughs> Hey guys, what's up? This is my, I think, week 23 review for the DVD Fiends. Uh, and I, uh, we just had Lucio Fulci week, so it's going to be hard to top that week. But uh, I've decided to do uh, a gem that's kind of forgotten. Probably because it's never been released on American DVD. But this film I chose to do, this is the Region 2 of the movie Prison. It's nice, it says that uh, Optimum, what is it? Optimum Classic and MGM released this one. If you guys aren't familiar with this movie, it's uh, Ronnie Harlan's first American movie, I believe. Ronnie Harlan did such action fi films as The Long Kiss Goodnight, Cliffhanger, Die Hard 2, uh, some other ones. But uh, Prison basically follows the story of a haunted prison. I'm not big on haunting movies, but when you add in prison and, horror and gore in the equation, I really enjoy it. I'm a big fan of prison stuff like Oz and uh, stuff like that. I really enjoy prison films and prison dramas and they're a lot of fun, but this movie is a ghost story, prison drama with lots of violence. Empire Pictures released it, if you guys are familiar with Empire Pictures, they did stuff, it's like the band guy, Charles Band's thing, or Richard Band, I don't remember which, but uh, they used to produce that, they released stuff like uh, Ghoulies 2 and uh, what was that, Ghost Town, lots of fun stuff, they either had really cool special effects or some pretty good gore or both. This film's no different from either of those, has both. Uh, has Viggo Morgenstern in it, if you guys know. This has got to be one of his first roles. Also has Lane Smith in it, who you might confuse for Lee Army. Uh, I always thought he kind of looked like Lee Army. Also has Lincoln, what's this guy's name? I'm going to need to pronounce it. Uh, I'm sorry about this, guys. It's Lincoln Kilpatrick. Easy name to pronounce, I just forgot it. If you guys, uh, he is in Fortress. He plays the old prisoner as well. Another uh, unorthodox prison film. It also has uh, Chelsea Field in it. Uh, she was Woman at Arms in Master Universe movies. She's also in Death Spa, which is similar to this. You know, not as good though. But uh, it also, this movie also has Tom Lister in it. That's Debo or uh, Zeus. People might be familiar with him as Zeus. But uh, this film is pretty cool. It's got some cool effects, especially a scene with barbed wire and a police officer. I'll show that. Uh, it's got some, it's got, uh, you gotta love Zeus in it, you gotta love Tom Lister, I love him in it. 
grew up on Tom Lister, watching stuff like Hologram Man and No Hold Barred. No Holds Barred. But, uh... We're not gonna hurt you, man. Just put the gun down, okay? Listen to me, Johnson. If you guys haven't seen Prison, it's a really fun, late 80s prison ghost story with violence, and it really deserves an American DVD release. If you guys want to go pick this up, go over to Amazon.com UK and pick it up. It should probably cost you about 12 bucks with shipping. That's pretty good, brand new. Uh, just an underrated movie. I mean, underrated horror movie. Maybe Randy Harlan should go back to directing some cool horror movies. I know his, his movie, what, he do The Exorcist at the beginning? That wasn't too good, but I mean, maybe if he got something else. I don't know. But uh, thanks for watching, and check out the other reviews coming up. Uh, I want to apologize to you, Resident Vania. Resident Vania, I'm working on those right now, and they'll be out soon. Thanks a lot. See you guys. Bye.